Deputy Speaker, there are so many frontline people who have carried us through this difficult time and will continue to as, it, as this health crisis goes on. Uh, the supermarket workers, the drivers who've made sure deliveries get to the door, those people who, who work 24 hours a day in some cases to keep those supermarket shelves stocked and restocked deserve our thanks. Another very visible frontline worker is the Centrelink worker. And I was really pleased to be able to help the Centrelink workers at Katoomba, Springwood and Windsor take a moment to have coffee or donuts, just as a small gesture of thanks for the long queues, the distressed people they've been trying to help through this process. I also want to commend the volunteers in my electorate who helped me reach out to older people. Uh, people like Christy and Jules, Shane and Anne, Suzanne and Catherine, uh, who made nearly a thousand calls to older people just to check that they were okay. Uh, some of them were quick chats and some were much lengthier conversations and hopefully that helped people at a time when they may have been very alone and isolated in their homes. We were also able to solve a few other problems for them and we'll continue to do that because this isn't over and we know that and as a community we all have to accept that.